the crypto market, financial markets, the stock markets, Shiba Inu, Dogecoin, cryptos are continuing to crash and to go lower. It's happening every single day. And what is the reason for this madness? Is this madness, is this bleeding out going to ever stop? And in this video, we are going to be talking about this, providing real information, real data to back up what we think is going to happen next. So make sure you watch this video until the very end. You cannot miss this emergency video. What's up, Miles? It's ladies and gentlemen here. Make sure you subscribe with notifications on so you do not miss these time-sensitive videos that I make about cryptocurrencies every single day. And if you love cryptocurrencies, even though the market is going down, yes, we are seeing red, but this happens over and over again. And red can only last for so long, so don't beat yourself up. Don't be panicking. It's going to be okay. Cryptos always recover. And if you love that, if you believe in that, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. And let me know in the comments if you agree with that statement. And if you want to get access to the most profitable crypto trading alerts in the world, where we do short-term day trade alerts, we have a new coin that's coming out that could potentially 50x this week. If you want to get access to that, speak to me on the phone. Go ahead and join the Patreon. The link will be in my video description or in my top pinned comment. And if you want to learn how to day trade cryptocurrencies, become an expert in technical analysis, go ahead and join my crypto trading course where I teach you all of my secrets so that you can make money yourself in crypto. Right now, I have a 40% sale off while you can go ahead and grab it. Also, make sure you follow all of my socials. Check out all the links in my video description. And don't forget to get your two free stocks from Webull worth up to $3,500. All you have to do is create an account, deposit one penny using my link below. Going to Coin Market Cap, we are seeing just more red. It just does not stop. It does not want to stop. It's getting pretty bad. We have some cryptos, Solana down 15% in a single day. Look at this, guys. The second column here is the last seven-day performance of these cryptos. Some cryptos, what we are seeing is 30% down in the last seven days. That is crazy. 30% down, 40% down. The crypto market is looking extremely bearish. As I have been saying, we are in a bear market. The market is continuing to go down. And if you watched my video yesterday and the videos before, I tell you exactly where we are headed and why, and it continues to happen, unfortunately. Unfortunately, the bearish scenario is happening. And as we see yesterday, there was a massive crash. There was $136 billion that was wiped out. Trillions of dollars are being wiped out. Billions of dollars in the crypto market, and it is not looking good at all. So one of the primary reasons why cryptocurrencies went down really big and fast yesterday and today is because of liquidations. People are leveraging cryptos because they are bullish on cryptos. And when some news comes out, like Russia, they're banning crypto. We have Wall Street, big crashes in the stock market. When these things are happening, they have huge effects on the crypto market. And that's why we are seeing these crazy dips. There's a lot of FUD with Russia, which I made a video the other day, which you should also check out what they are trying to do. But it doesn't mean that Russia is going to do it. It's the Bank of Russia, not the president, not the actual government, but the Bank of Russia. There's banks all around the world that are trying to stop cryptocurrencies and people that do honor cryptocurrencies and even have made Bitcoin and cryptos their legal currency like El Salvador. These big banks are after them. They're trying to attack them to cut them off. Cryptos are the enemy of the big banks, ladies and gentlemen. And they are the enemies because big banks make money by allowing you and giving you the opportunity to put money in their banks and you get like 0.1% a year or something. That's how they make their money because they get all this money from you which don't need to spend all of your money right now and they're able to leverage all of this money that doesn't need to be used for their own financial gain and betterment that they can make money off of your money. That's how banks win and succeed and that's why they make money. But cryptocurrencies are here to put banks out of business because cryptos you can actually put your money in somewhere and it appreciates in value and not 1% a year, not 3%, but hundreds of percents every single year. There is no asset, there is no other place you can put your money that will make you money like investing in Dogecoin or Shiba Inu. But remember, nothing of this video is financial advice. It is just my own opinion for entertainment purposes only. Now, taking a look at this data here, it is called the stable coin supply ratio of Bitcoin. And what we are seeing is that has happened many times in the past. The Bollinger Bands for this supply ratio, whenever they touch, whenever they cross, as we are seeing is about to happen, generally causes explosive moves in the crypto market. And this next explosive move, because we have already been going down explosively, the next explosive move is going to be a bullish 
reversal, a huge bottom. We are getting very, very close. There is hope very soon. There is light in the end of the tunnel and the light is coming closer. It is more visible each and every single day that we move forward to it. So we are now approaching a very bullish signal here, ladies and gentlemen. And if we take a look, the additional reasons, as I have said, the stock market is going down really fast and going down quickly and going down hard because of inflation, because of all this flood that we are seeing on the internet with governments and things and all of it added together. Shutdowns and viruses are causing fear and panic and is causing this dip in all of these financial markets together. And when all of these things happen together, it brings generally all of the markets together down as well. So now if we go ahead and take a look at the whole crypto market, the crypto market chart, which we can see by looking at Bitcoin, we are seeing a very substantial dip. We ended up breaking past this huge level of support and we are now forming a head and shoulders pattern, which is a very bearish sign. And we are breaking out of this bearish pattern, meaning that we are going to be headed lower. But what we are seeing as of right now, as of this very hour, is a potential strong level of support, which is holding up approximately $34,000. Now this actually end up might being the bottom of the crypto market, but that's just a pure guess. It's a possibility. Of course, we can bounce up, we can go down, but there is a possibility that this could actually be the bottom. But the way the charts are looking, ladies and gentlemen, just in my honest opinion, I think that the market is still going to head lower and that Bitcoin is most likely going to head to $30,000. Now, if you don't like this, I'm sorry to break it to you, but this is completely the honest truth. The honest truth is the possibility that we can continue to go lower because we are in a very, very strong and violent downtrend which means that we are having lower lows and lower highs and we are just continually confirming this bearish trend. And this bearish trend completely is in concordance if you hold Shiba Inu, Dogecoin, all of these cryptocurrencies are completely relevant to this chart right here. If Bitcoin and this whole crypto market as we are seeing through the Bitcoin chart continues to go lower, your altcoins are going to continue to go lower except some of these really small micro cap coins. We, there is going to be a new coin released this week most likely, which is going to be a fair launch, which means there's going to be a crazy opportunity where it can 50X or do some crazy gains. Now to get access to that, make sure you join the Patreon, we get early access. But statistically, what we are seeing in the market is it is looking like we are going to head lower. I personally think like I just reiterated is that Bitcoin is going to hit 30,000 and we could actually, the, the market is so bearish, we could actually hit much lower than $30,000, but that's going to provide an incredible buying opportunity for many people around the world. No matter how bearish things are, when Bitcoin hits 30K, people are coming out of the closets with their cash money from all over the world to buy this dip. People are going to buy this dip like never before because Bitcoin was just at 70K and you can now buy a Bitcoin at $30,000. You can now buy Dogecoin uh, pennies you know, for super cheap. You can buy Shiba super cheap. And when the market does reverse, it starts to head up. These dips that you buy, that I am buying, are going to make crazy gains. Look, just to give you an example, this is just Bitcoin. We're using Bitcoin as an example. Let's say Bitcoin goes all the way down to $30,000, okay? No matter if you put $10 in it, if you put $50, if you put $1,000, the price of a crypto doesn't matter. It's the performance. So if your money doubles, whether the price is $2 billion a coin or the price is $0.04 cents a coin, your money doubles. It doesn't matter. But just to give you an example, let's say you sell all of your position right now and Bitcoin goes down to $30,000. You buy Bitcoin to $30,000 and then it goes immediately back up to $69,000 in 30 to 60 days. You would make 140%. And we know that Bitcoin is one of the slowest performing cryptos in the world. Now, if we take a look at just Cardano, Cardano is back at a dollar. Let's say you buy Cardano and it goes back to all time high this year. If you buy the dip at Cardano, even right now, and it goes back up, you'll make 200% plus just in buying the dip. So that's the power of dollar cost averaging and buying these dips. So overall, in conclusion, there's no need to panic. There's no need to fear, but we are getting amazing opportunities to make some money by buying these dips. And if you don't have cash, continue to hold on. That's my personal strategy. When things are getting shaky, when things are getting fearful, you continue to weather out the storm because eventually we are going to see green very fast. And that is most likely going to happen this year, the next coming months, maybe in a few days. We don't know. The crypto market always, when things are extremely bearish like they, has, they have been many times before, out of nowhere, the green comes, out of nowhere, massive pumps come. They completely forget about the red. 
And likewise, when people are in the red, they completely forget about the green they just had. Now, if you want to get access to these new cryptos, these awesome trade alerts that are making people money, go ahead and join the Patreon right now. The link is in my video description. Give this video a thumbs up. If you would consider it, blow up the comment section with something that you want to tell me that you think I should add to my videos. Any questions, comments, or concerns, and I will see you all later. Don't panic. It's okay. I will see you all later. Have a great night.